Okay, we're gonna try to ampule bromine today. Got this very ugly jar. Obviously it leaked out, it's already on my fingers. Uh, you can see the tag is turned half orange and it's still white where the tape is. <laughs> Pretty amazing. And we're gonna try to ampule this mess. Got some good ampules here. I'm gonna try to suspend it in this ice water and then melt the top. Got plenty of safety equipment on, hopefully. Uh, as you always worry about, this glass might explode or crack or something. All right, step one. Get this ugly jar open. Oh boy. I'm pretty sure I don't want to breathe that, whatever it was. And bromine is just, just destroying the bag, as you can see, and the whole inside of the jar. Not the glass so much, but the everything else. Wow. This jar is just fuming everywhere. Alright, now let's see if we can get some of this. If there's anything left in here. There it is. This is like truly mad science. Truly mad science. Got to keep moving because the clouds are not dissipating very nicely here. You can see that my tape is starting to fail here. Not quite going as planned, but we also expect the things to not really go as planned. So I think this. Uh, Poor thing is going to end up falling, so I may end up having to hold it somehow. down. Oh, we've got a bromine bubble there. Which is no good. That just popped. So that one's pretty much toast. We'll try again. Try to take another crack at this apple here. Set up a fan to keep the flames Seems blowing the right direction, namely away from me. Might have come out all right. Get another one. 
This is scary stuff, man. The wax on the top of this bottle completely obliterated by the bromine. Utterly, completely. There's a wax seal on the top and it's gone. Marginal. Incidentally, if this is cold off enough, we might be able to test it for leaks. If you hold it upside down, it looks like it's not leaking out, so that's good. This one might actually be okay too. Let's see. Still more of this dastardly stuff to get rid of. Oh, that's so scary. I set up a fan behind me to keep the air blowing the right direction. Check this one. This one might be okay too. But this third one I don't think is any good. I'm not gonna tip it now because that glass is hot. It might be, we'll check it when it cools. Bromine in glass ampules, perfectly fine. Apparently those worked well. The bromine in a ground glass stopper with silicone grease on it, you can see the bromine's getting out of there. Uh, it's, it doesn't smell though, so it's, it's pretty well contained, but it's getting out. So you definitely need the glass ampules. <laughs> 